Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying a four Atkins bars. Uh, I think they're all Atkins Indulge. Yes, mm -hmm. they are. Uh, we have the Dulce de Leche, the Chocolate Caramel Fudge. A strawberry Cheesecake and a Peppermint Patty. And these three are dessert bars and Kevin's are Peppermint Patties, so they're patties. not bars. Um, the Peppermint Patties and the Dulce de Leche were $5.99 at Target. The two in the middle, the strawberry and the chocolate caramel fudge were $6.29 at Meyer. So they were cheaper at Target. I don't know if they were on sale or not, but that's that's how much we paid it. $5.99 at Target. So Dulce de Leche. Of course, I'm gonna tear this box all to pieces. They glued them very well, like yeah. they made a gold or something. Yeah, because you're <laughs> supposed to be able to put the flap back under there. Well, clearly it's so hard to open. Okay, so you get five of these bars. Dulce de Leche Cake Dessert Bar, rich and creamy dessert favorite. These have three grams of net carbs, one gram of sugar. It says rich in fiber. This is, ooh, this smells good. This is a treat bar. Um, it is 130 calories. It's not sticky on the outside. It's almost like it's a covered thing. And Ooh, on the so back, they are talking about the Atkins diet. We're not here to teach you about Atkins. No, if it's very similar to keto. Though. If you're, yes, very, very similar to keto. If you're interested in that, you can look it up on Atkins.com. We're just here to tell you if these are any good. <laughs> they taste good. Okay. That's what they look like on the inside, by the way. So that looks like a, no, it's like a caramel nougat or something in the middle. Hmm. I like the flavors. Mm -hmm. it has that good runny caramel flavor. It's sweet. Mm -hmm. Texture's not bad either. I mm -hmm. thought at first I would like the texture. Right. But it, it's a it's got a good chewiness to it. It's not like caramel really, but it's kind of like a nougat you get in a candy bar of some kind. Right. And I do think if you're if you're doing Atkins um, and you you can have that, I think that's terrific because mm -hmm. honestly, it surprises me how sweet it is. Because yeah, it's, they're super sweet. Uh, because usually with like Atkins and keto, I don't get that. We haven't had a, a things with that much sweetness to it. And that's a lot of sweet. It is. So I'm impressed that you're allowed to have that. Yeah. Well, see, I, from what I remember of Atkins from ages ago, you get, you only get 20 grams of carbs right at the beginning. Once you hit your, your stride though, you can increase those a little bit when you're maintaining. Right. So three grams, is this thing three grams in that? Three, right? uh-huh. Um, so three probably wouldn't be something you put in your regular diet, but it would be your maintaining diet probably. Okay. Like I said, I don't know. I haven't done keep, uh, Atkins on a very, very long time. We did do Atkins years ago. Oh, yeah, and, and ages, ages ago. Eight whole packs of bacon and... <laughs> and we did lose weight. Oh, yeah. But it wasn't something that I could maintain no. because I like bread. I like bread and a lot. And stuff like that. I like bread. I Pastas. like cheese. I like crackers. And yeah. I missed having bread. I, I eat bread right now. Of course, nowadays, that, that's been 20 years ago. Um, nowadays, they probably have low carb bread and stuff. Well, uh, back then, they didn't uh, have 35 calorie bread. Yeah. Now, the only bread I buy is 35 calorie yeah. bread. And so it's not as bad as what I used to eat years ago. These are the chocolate caramel fudge. They also have three grams of uh, net carbs and they're 130 calories. No. It's the chocolate flavor. I think it fails badly on the chocolate flavor. Don't it, forget um, about it. It's awful. You probably don't think it's bad. I think it tastes like a um, um, Tootsie Roll. Yeah. Cheap chocolate. Very waxy, cheap. It's really not chocolate. I mean, think about it. Tootsie Rolls aren't chocolate. No. It's a chocolate flavored whatever. Right. Okay. That's, but that's what it's you a, get. It's whatever artificial chocolate flavor they use in that. Tootsie Roll and all those other ones. And lip gloss and all those. 
It has that same flavor. It doesn't taste like six dollars and twenty nine cents. No, no. <laughs> Actually, I like Tootsie Rolls better than this. Uh, yeah, I do too. <laughs> I, it, it just tastes cheap. It, it yeah. really and, and some very people, artificial chocolate. Some people will probably like that, and if you don't get a lot of sweet. You're probably very grateful for this. Yeah, because it's still sweet, but you can't beat that. It caramel. depends on how desperate you get. Yeah, how much you're gonna like the that. caramel one's a hundred times better though. Um, this is the strawberry cheesecake. Now that box I opened fine. This one, once again, I've torn the top because it, some it's of them were just yeah. Um, strawberry cheesecake. Three grams of net carbs again. One gram of sugar. Um. These are made in Denver, Colorado. Well, they're distributed out of it. Oh, it's a product of Canada. Oh. Was, Again. was Atkins Canadian or is that just where the food was made? Um, okay. Uh, one bar, 34 grams, 130 calories. Again, are all these? The same? No, the last one's different. So all the dessert, the treat bars have been 130 calories. And they've all had the same grams of net carbs and everything. So strawberry cheesecake. It's pretty. Mm -hmm. It smells good. It's not bad. It's a light, a very light strawberry flavor. It's very, again, it's kind of an artificial flavor, but it's not bad, but I'm left with an artificial chemically like flavor. Um, I don't think it's bad. I, no. I do taste strawberry. Mm -hmm. It is a light strawberry, but it's there. So I've swallowed it and I can definitely I still taste get the strawberry. Yeah, I can definitely taste the strawberry. Well, it's almost honestly like I've had a strawberry milkshake or something. That's I can the, see that. That's the kind yeah. of strawberry it is. It's like a milkshaking mm -hmm. type. Um, I, I would much rather have that than the chocolate. Oh, yeah, any day. Um, but. Get this one. The Dulce, the <laughs> yeah, those are those are out of the three. I think those are the best, yeah. and those are by far the sweetest oh, yeah. of yeah. those bars. I would have those in the house all the time. Yeah, and then the strawberry one, I would hit every once in a because while because you're really gonna feel like you're, you know, because the keto on keto and Atkins is if you don't get a lot of sweet stuff no. at all, so you're really gonna feel like you're getting something great by eating one of those. Now, lastly, these are the peppermint patties, and they're. Um, yeah, I'm curious. Numbers are different on these. So these have two grams of net carbs, and they're dark chocolate covered. I should say the full name. Dark chocolate covered peppermint patties. Uh, no artificial colors, flavors, or preservatives. Two grams of net carbs, one gram of sugar. Smile. <laughs> um, one piece is 90 calories. And all of these give the same spiel on the back spiel um on the back they talk about the atkins diet so oh Love that. that's chewy mm -hmm. wow white they're trying to duplicate that york peppermint patty look whereas the york peppermint patty is almost like powdered sugar that melts in your mouth mm -hmm. this does this not. is very chewy this is more like a bar you know, mm -hmm. it's got texture to it, and you know something what, you actually though? have to chew. Honestly, flavor's not bad. I don't mind it at all. No. I actually very mint, strong mint. Yeah, I actually like that mint flavor. And once again, I can see where something like this would be greatly appreciated if you're on this diet, mm -hmm. yeah. um, because it is sweet. And because it is chewy, that's actually a, a positive thing because you feel like you're getting more. Right. You're actually, it, you, you're having to take your time with it and stuff like that. So I actually like these. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, they're, they're not bad. They, they do leave a little bitterness to, to, in your mouth from the dark chocolate kind of flavor, right. but, but did, it's not bad. Yeah, that did not bother me. No, it doesn't bother me because, you know, that's that's what it's supposed to be. It's but, dark, yeah. Yeah. It, yeah, it didn't bother me at all. So I think, uh, yeah, three of the four, I think that uh, yeah. is really good. And if you don't mind that, very artificial chocolate flavor. You might like the chocolate ones. It's just for me and Tammy, it's, we've all, neither one of us really love that really super artificial chocolate flavor. Right. Yeah, you might buy those and be like, I don't know what they were talking about. They're crazy. But you have to remember too, we're trying these as people who eat whatever we want to. And you know, if you're on a very limited diet with very limited sugar, then this might seem like 
wow, you know, yeah. to you. So um, um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I will have a picture of these for you at the end, and thanks for watching.